So guys, a band or a DJ adds life to our events. Period. And I know this because I actually have so many questions about people's band bookings. So in this video, I will be answering your questions about wedding band and DJ bookings for your wedding in 2020. Hello people, I am Disha and welcome to Alter Answers, this channel I created because I asked too many questions and my parents have threatened to disown me if I ask one more. Like me, if you are planning to have your wedding this year then I am sure you have a lot of doubts about your wedding band and DJ bookings as well. So to answer these questions, I have not just Mangalore's favourite but favourites of Mumbai, Dubai, Rajasthan, Jaipur, Kerala, basically all over. So say hello to the favorite two of ROL the band Ashish Palana and Ria De Souza. So the first question that we have is an important one. So it says that my band is asking for a postponement fee to postpone the wedding. Is that up for negotiation? So Ashish, what do you say? So if you've already paid in advance to the band and the band is asking for an additional fee, I don't think you need to pay an additional fee just to postpone your date. You can ask them to just carry forward the same at once. Unless it is pushed way forward into 2021, you have to keep in mind that it is within 2020. And then I don't think you need to pay them an extra amount. Okay, that's great. But what advice would you give to a couple who has booked your band for their wedding? How would they go about this or what would you do in this situation? Ria? If your date of event is uh, within the next three months, I have two options for you. You can either cancel the booking and expect the complete refund from the band. The second option is you can postpone your date to somewhere within the end of 2020 and the band will carry this advance to that date of your choice and play on the same thing. There's no confusion. Awesome. But just to be sure, what questions do I need to ask my band or DJ so that I can avoid any last minute confusion? On a normal day, there is a contract drafted by the band and the client or the party confirms it. But under these circumstances, uh, you can I suggest you make a fresh contract which includes your points and the band and then you finally draft your contract, your new contract and then confirm it from both the sides. I don't think this will lead to any confusion in the end. Contract is key people, so look up your booking contracts right away. So Ashish, what if my band or DJ is not available on the date that I've planned to postpone the wedding to? Should I ask for a refund? So since you're all sailing on the same boat, I don't think it'll be right on your part to ask for a refund if the band is not available on the postponed date. Um, everyone's in the same circumstance. So I, my best advice is you push it to a date since you're already pushing it to a date. You can push it to a certain date where all your vendors are available. So that they don't lose out on money, neither do you. So I think it should be that. I said the exact same thing guys. See, what you need to do is call all your vendors and tell them the date you have in mind. Just ask them if they're available for that date. Put all their dates down if they have some specific dates they are available and come up with a common date. As much as possible, do not cancel because it's important for them too. So just try to plan a wedding around everyone's availability and not just you, even your vendors will be happy on the happiest day of your life. And when you're happy and you know it, say I do. Thank you Ashish and Ria for being the best and answering our questions relating to band and DJs. If you have any band or DJ related questions that I haven't answered yet, then ask them in the comment section below. I'm super excited to call and annoy people and get your answers for you. Boss, please boss. Ah, please. If you like this video and the answers I brought you, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us on social media. Stay tuned and thank you for watching.